Jones. Quandale Dingle here. <laughs> hey guys, it's Aiden, and we're react today. We're reacting to a little westerner. Let's get. Okay. So far, so good. This is so far so good. Yeah. Oh, like this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The camera angles look great. I like that character already. Hey, Ross and friends. Oh, gosh dang it. Why is that with like Percy with Gordon's face? Yeah, that's the guy from NWR Origins. My dear boy. Percy! Don't forget those little shunting lessons we've got this afternoon. I Gordon shunting. Um, Andy. You've come a long way since you were built all those years ago. He's wise, Jesus. I haven't forgotten. <laughs> Did you have something to ask me? Oh no, it's fine. Well, not noise is squeaky. I mean, nose. Is there something wrong? Oh no, nothing. Just hoping that our fellow engine Oliver remembers how signals work. Just like Percy. Percy the Gordon. Remember Percy in the signal? Nope, he didn't know how signal worked. Holy crap. Well, Oliver's reckless. Should be awesome. See you this afternoon. <laughs> this blinker, are you seeing this? Oliver's more reckless than Percy is. Are leading to the docks. Hey. Stop, you idiot. <gasps> How did they stop when they didn't even hit the brakes? I think they did. Or not. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, um, sorry. Well, I mean, no one's that stupid. You have to admit that was funny. <laughs> okay, there's Doug with Donald's face. Good afternoon, Will. What's the. And Doug the Donald. There's an engine with Murdoch's face. What? George? Well,. What's the new Who's Hurrah? Murdoch is an orange engine. Well, all right. All right. I'm afraid. Dieselization. It's happening. Oh, God. Yes. I thought it was just a rumor. So did we. Then they came. Trials at first. Now they're actually replacing us. <laughs> you know, Jesus. I never knew that. Take care. There's the the I actually did not know this. Look. All diesel now. They will move onto the branch line soon enough. I can't guarantee anything. Just <coughs> take care. Take you care too. now. Who's a happy Just birthday? I'm, I'm, sorry, that's my background. I'm, I gotta go AFK real quick. I'm doing a project. It's his birthday. No, I'm sorry. It's for saying that. Just crack a joke. Sorry. You nearly caused an accident? You could have hurt one of our passengers. If you keep this up, one day it will happen. Oh, please. I had a firm enough grasp on the situation. And for your information, the signal was green. It was red. 
signalman changed it himself. Maybe the signal changed after Oliver passed it. Listen, Riddles, you're young. You shouldn't jump in to defend someone so easily. You're young too! You look like a younger engine! Signalman's error, Andy. In other words, bad timing. Yes, rules are rules, but that's- Oh, hey, my friend's here. Who's Why are you back early? The only reason you're saying that is to get him out of- Is that Emma? Oh, yes. Grateful that the crash was avoided. In any case. Well done on nearly beating the record. That's some engine with Emily's face. Like next time, eh? Thank you, uh, Amy. If there is a next time. He's duck. Oh, not you too. I'm not talking about your earlier shenanigans, Oliver. I've got news from Paddy. Oh, the oh, screeching boy. sounds. Here we go again. I'm serious. It's already started. George is no longer taking the express. A diesel is. Do you mean? Yep. They're coming. They've already started with the main lines. George says we'll be next. Oh, come on. Are you guys actually believing this? Listen, diesels are not going to come here, and we are not going to get replaced. And what makes you so sure? Well, I've lived here all my life, longer than any of you guys. It doesn't matter where you've lived, Oliver. You don't get much in the way of experience if you've lived on one branch Yo, can you all shut your the life. Fuck up? Oh, really? Because I know the people who went online. I trust them. They won't replace us. Oliver, wherever you live, things change. How does he not understand that? Jeremy's being ridiculous. He needs to get a grip. I've been here since I was built, and I've never been threatened about replacement. Since I was built? Nah, I'm thinking about this too much. Yeah, of course you are, Oliver. What should I say? Mr. Oliver! <laughs> Mr. Oliver! Evening, Amy. <laughs> How are your shunting lessons with riddles going? Very well, in fact. I... He accidentally shunted you under the coal chute with his trucks. Sorry. Aside from that one little thing... <laughs> they spent hours trying to clean out your funnel. Hey, you can laugh now, but soon enough I'll make a fine shunter of him. <laughs> Give it a couple of decades. He's far better than you are, anyway. No, he's not. Yeah. You don't even know what a truck looks like. What? That thing over there? Just Bro, what did you do? Well... My thing is glitching out. Okay. Where did he go? And, uh, here with yeah, I'm gonna have to reload my screen. It does look interesting. Okay. Remember what Jeremy said. Now we can finally continue. Hardly a danger, though. Look how fat he is. Your point? <laughs> He'd sink our rails. We've no chance of being replaced. Jeremy's worrying about nothing. Mm -hmm. What if they haven't finished yet? Eh? What are you on about now? They haven't finished. <clears throat> so, sorry to disturb you, but I've got a shipment of engine parts that need delivering to Swindon Works. Now, oh, no. we don't have clearance to go into the works area, so just leave the trucks on the platform outside and come back here. Any volunteers? I'll do it. Good. You should make it back before midnight. <sighs> it's a death sentence. Oh no. It's starting. It has begun, everyone. 
What are you trying to hide? Everything. They're hiding everything from you. Wait, that's Percy's face. Holy crap. I'm gonna play again. Alright. Jeremy? Well, what happened to you? Isn't it obvious? Scrap. I'm sorry. Don't be. We'll get you over. For all I've been through, a flipping burst cylinder it takes me out. What are you doing here? I'm trying to find out exactly what they're planning. It's several years, nothing, and something. Bro, what just happened? Once. <sighs> what happened to my video? This? We're a dying breed, no. Jeremy. The video I'm Every trying to play. Getting withdrawn and scrapped. Diesel is dead. Wait a minute. You can't really hear it. Barely any of us left. However, there are some areas where steam engines can't be replaced. But not yet in anything. Branch lines. Rats, what's been going on over there? Making a solution. The publicity's been a god. Why is it why is my video so loud? They know what it does. What they're making isn't going to change the world. No, I'm gonna play something louder. I heard it down, right? Oh my god. There's not much time. Just <gasps> just uh listen. I can't hear anything. Exactly. This place never dies down. Were you spotted when you came in here? Oh no. Yeah. Wait, what? They're coming here now. Go! Go and don't look back! Don't worry about me! No, don't leave him behind! Bro, this literally sounds like my video. Loud video. I don't know what's wrong with them, man. On my side's working, what the heck is going on? <laughs> Where on earth were you? Managers getting more and more annoyed. I got held up. With what? Diesels. I thought the live. I thought the live already ended. What's all what? this about, Jeremy? You arrived several hours late, and I've received calls from Swindon about you causing trouble there. But sir, I'm having none of that. In any case, they've agreed to send a new engine here for a trial run. Yes, sir. You're to do Riddles' jobs for the rest of the day, seeing as you couldn't be in time to start yours. Don't be a dick. You know something, don't you? About that new engine. Listen. Just the last. You shouldn't worry so much. There's always a light. Even if you don't see it at first. Jeremy can always see the light. Especially considering he left his lamp on. Good morning to you too, Oliver. Did you fancy a sleepover at Swindon or something? Always with the jokes, eh? You wouldn't be laughing if you had seen what I saw. Oh yeah? Try me. It's over. Guess what, Oliver? All your talk about diesels never replacing us is just wrong. 
It's already begun, and there's nothing you can do to stop it. So stop acting. No one's like even chatting on the live. Just try laughing at that. Yeah, we'll probably hate. I don't know. The audio's on. I just don't know what's going on. Did you enable your comments? No. Then why is nobody chatting? I don't know, dude. I just... Ever since I woke up, I just wanted to get this reaction over with. I'm really tired, man. It's done. Okay. What? You took your time. Start it up. Oh, no. The study of another one. It's a branch line not too far from here. You should know where it is. Wait for them to show. Hey, another one's here. Hey, it's Brian doing it. Oh, now nah, who look who it is. What? What? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing? Okay. Yeah. Sorry. They it's happening. Building. <laughs> yeah. ah. guys. Looks like we'll just have to. It's wait happening, and... everyone. It's We're getting replaced. To make assumptions about these things. That... No, that's too fast. Sorry. What just happened? Have I need to leave in eleven fifty. Fifteen. It's not like I don't. Want it's all right, man. The way he acts, Amy. Okay. I'm trying being more understanding. For me, it's eleven thirteen. This is Oliver. You're talking. Same. And this is you who I'm talking about. And now it's raining. I think we're both in a le the same time You guys just zones. live in a different town as me. Hmm. Well, I, okay, I don't even want to... If you I say my location, like. someone's going to hack me and find me. It's easier to express himself when he's alone. You think? I know. Hey, I wouldn't be surprised if he's contemplating your words right this very second. I'll come back in 11.30, though. I don't know. It's also raining. For me, it's sunny. Oh. What does LPS think so far? She's here. It's freaking 2 a.m. It always rains where I am. It always rains. Wait, never mind. I'm working on a custom right now. Yeah, well, it's cool. This is real. This this right here is real. It's finally a chat. This is real. I swear to God, dude. This is Elon Musk. Yep. <laughs> There's so many now the chat's probably. I think I think I think I'm gonna come back in eleven twenty-five or eleven twenty. Alright. Probably probably eleven twenty. The, di the diesels are back. Oh my god. It'll only take five minutes. It doesn't have a face. Now I need to leave. Holy crap. Wow. <sighs> okay. Oh, just, just what is going on? Ah, oh, Oliver. I see you've met our new engine. Whew. That is an understatement. What's it doing here? It's just on trial for the time being. It's a trial. It's been built too. Speaking of which, Oliver, you've got the afternoon off. Hmm? The diesel here will be taking your trains for you. Think of it as a. How dare you? Test run. Is that so? What's the top speed? According to Swindon, fifty. 50 mile per hour diesel versus 70 mile per hour steam engine. You do realize this thing's got no chance. Well, it's a good thing I'm employed to run a railway and not a racetrack. Speeds are well and good for record breaking, not for running trains on time. You're pretty brave for trying, mate. But I'm going to tell you now, 
you shouldn't bother. Looks like you better get going. What's strange is the fact it doesn't have a face. Yes, it just ha it just goes eh, right at Oliver. There it goes with no face. Afternoon, Oliver. Is that the new diesel Jeremy was talking about? Guess it's not one of those big bulky machines we're used to seeing, eh? Yeah. Now, if you don't mind me, Amy, I'll just be enjoying my afternoon off. Your afternoon off? Hey, it's, well, a, it's a Amy it's Rose engine. Diesel a chance. 50 miles an hour. What's up with him? He's got a bit of a confidence streak at the moment. It'll blow over soon enough. You forget that his last confidence streak nearly caused me to derail myself. Oh, let it go already. I've already said that wasn't Oliver's fault. That's SpongeBob's wake up horn sound. Right. The results of the first trial on this branch line are in. And I have to say that the results are... As expected. What? I mean, come on. I've been working here since I was built. I know this line like the back of my buffers. And you're seriously thinking that the, the boxy over there has a chance. Not to mention the fact I'm faster too. Hello, flying camera productions, and this is just like where it takes a shortcut. So, the point that I'm trying to make is simple. Oliver is getting too cocky for his own good. Yeah. You're not taking the passenger run tomorrow. This is this is like this is literally like Gordon takes a shortcut where they say I know this railway like the back of my buffers. They're lying. Entire afternoon, Boxy, as you so eloquently put it, performed faster. Kept to time all without a single mishap or complaint from the passengers, whereas you, Oliver, well, let's just say the passengers aren't too happy with your constant near misses and delays. What? No, no, that's impossible. There must be a mistake. You have to handle the truth, Oliver. Sorry, Oliver, but there is nothing to check. As per control's orders, you are to stay in the sheds until we can find a better use for you. Sir, is there nothing you can do? Absolutely nothing, Jeremy. Control's word on the matter is final. You son of a bitch. They just roll off without a word. I gotta go AFK, I'm about to eat breakfast. Wait, I like you can eat. something else. I'm about to have, I might have breakfast, hold on. I just feel really bad for Oliver now. Yep. Oh no, what's he gonna do? He's playing something devious. Well, we're here. Mm. Mr. Oliver! Why am I not surprised? Mr. Oliver, I'm in the movie! Yep. Oh! Good morning, Mr. Sir. Ah! Uh, oh, uh, sorry, Mr. Sir. I, 
I, I did a beat to give you a fright. Mr. Uh, sir. So, is everything all right back there? Uh, uh, yes, Mr. Gigi. Uh, I just woke up this engine. Yes. Yes, you did. Sorry, sorry about that. Don't, don't you mind, Toad. He's an excitable little chap. Oh, sorry for blocking your path. Would you like me to get out of the way? Nah, don't bother. There's no point to it anyway. Well, your papers... Okay, James Jones back. Where did you get this brake van, though? Ah, Toad and I have always worked together. Really? A Midland engine with a Great Western brake van. I find that very hard to believe. Uh, yeah, yes. Well, you see, I was, uh, Swindon. Swindon. Born and bred, yes. Swindon built. Very well. I have no choice but to take your word for it. We need a shunter at the docks. Lots of shipments coming in. Think you can make yourself useful? Oh, yes, sir. Absolutely. Uh, goodbye, sir. Sorry for scaring you earlier. Hello, your computer has virus. Uh, okay, don't play those jokes. <laughs> Is that okay? Okay. I'm sorry, it's just, I don't know. It's... What? Him? He's not a shunting engine. He won't be able to cope with the work. And he stopped. You shut your... You shut your mouth. Oliver knows what to do. He's a chat of the series. I've orders to keep yes. him there. I see. I don't suppose you can make an exception just this once. After all, I am usual. I could do the help of a local resident. Toad is like, oh hell no! I, oh my god! You know, you still haven't told me your name. I do believe that is how you're meant to introduce yourself. It's Oliver. How about you, Ginty? And uh, I'm Toad. Toad. No, it's Mr. Oliver. Mr. Oliver. Mr. Oliver. You said I was very. I didn't mean to say it that way. Is that a custom face? Much better, Mr. Ginty. I do try my best. So, Oliver, it's not normal for an engine to be just wasting their time shut up in a shed. Would you care to explain? Uh, if you don't mind, of course, Mr. Oliver, sir. Ah, uh, what's there to tell? We should call him and Oliver instead. What he did. It turns out something like else. Like the food that olive. Engines that have that He's food. an olive. You are one of the luckier ones. Olive. Yes, sir. Something to do now, haven't you? Mr. Now, Oliver is an olive. Oh, yeah. Like what? You know, that. That's Thomas's face. <laughs> but edited. Is this the docks then? I recognize. Okay? You look like you've never seen a harbor before. I'm a Midland engine? The clue's in the name. But I have heard tales. Many tales. No matter how far one travels, no matter where we go, journey's end, it always comes at the sea. Huh? Well, what's that supposed to mean? Yeah, it's just an old saying. The sea is one of the few things in life that connects us all together. People see it as something that divides, but they're wrong. It's our destination. No matter who we are, we all roll along and end up there. Yeah, that's, that's true. Beyond. I'll be honest with you, I don't fancy getting myself wet. <laughs> I suppose it is an old saying, after all. Come on, then. What are you waiting for? Wait, wait up! How are you meant to shunt again? Oh, it's not so hard. Just take the wagons where they're meant to go. Go on, man. I shot at it. What's the worst that can happen? If you say so. Everything. Yep. Everything can go wrong. Everything went wrong. It was Everything like... can eat my balls. Oh my god. <laughs> bruh. Yeah, bro. moment. Take these to the good siding next to the station. It looks like the narrow gauge track. All right then. Okay, I'm just. Okay, I'm just. Come on, come on. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. That's enough. That's that's enough, that's enough memes. Right. Let's try this again. Oh no! It's gonna break something. <laughs> How does all of carry all of these? Wait a minute. 
Okay, yeah, great. I'm not gonna lie, now would be a good time to work. What on earth? Where are all of oh, a whole, so all of Larry oh, Carey's heavy stuff? It looks like he came off the tracks. What the hell? Yeah. Oh, finally. Oh boy. He's going down. Bro. Biggest bra moment. Yep. God dang, Oliver. We're going down to the car. Toad, I need your help. Of course, Mr. Gibbs, sir. How may I be of service? When he hits you, break as hard as you can. Do I have to, Mr. GT? It, it seems rather dangerous. Don't you yes, have it's any other you idea? Yes, you do, Come on, Toad. You can do it, Toad. Come on, Toad. We can do it. <laughs> See, Toad's a Chad. Uh, no wonder Jinx yes. is not around. Just like so, Miss Dolly. Imagine it was the mushroom, Toad. Hey, it's not bad considering the same thing I'm handling drugs. That doesn't stop it happening with coaches, though. You rush your work on. Oh, oh, toad, oh, toad, 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 I can't do it. I can't do it. Toad in Mario is just the worst character. In Mario, Toad is the worst. I don't like. Yeah, he's. Things done faster. You do realize yeah. that makes no sense. I like Toad in this, but That's not Toad really? in Mario. Because maybe if you slowed down a bit, you would have realized the truck's brakes were on. And maybe if you oh, showed. Now it's showed. Would have shut them off for you instead of oh, no. trying to pull the trucks. Oh no! I know another word. That means the process. So now we have to transfer all of the goods here into a whole new set of wagons, <laughs> thus delaying a train that was meant to leave now. Look, guys, where's my train? I can't find it on the good siding. You're good. You know that, right? <laughs> yeah. Now leave those trucks there. We've got some explaining to. And by we, you mean just me, don't you? <laughs> Not bad, Oliver. You're beginning to keep up now. Oi! You have to take part of the blame too, you know. What? Well, if it wasn't for you, I'd still be. Stuck How is Toad shit. sleeping on the line? Don't mention it, Amy. About your train, I would love to explain to you why it's not ready. But those are Where did he come from? Some wagons over there. Instead, Oliver will explain. It looks like Freddy's face, but edited. <laughs> so, you bounced back? Well, I needed a little push in the right direction. He is an odd one. Turned up saying he was transferred. Manager couldn't remember control confirming it. Spent hours fiddling with paperwork. Still also, if anyone's, if anyone's wondering why I'm sniffling, it's because, I don't know, my nose is stuffed up. And that's good enough for me. Okay, well oh. then. Oh, so we Ah, yes. Well, you see. I ain't have no fuel anymore. Oliver caught in 4K. Why are you leaving like that? I just wanted to see what? what you do left your own devices. You're just making that up. That stupid foghorn sound. Mr. Oliver, why are we in SpongeBob? That obvious, huh? Well, you don't exactly try to hide. Mm -hmm. it. Hello, Xavier, yeah, and yes, I'm my best to say, Mr. Oliver. Mr. Oliver. Oliver. That's my best. Boom, <laughs> boom, Mr. Oliver. Mr. Oliver, can you please throw me up a clip so I don't have to hear your dumb stories? It's hardly a complex puzzle, Oliver. It's just up to you. The missing pieces. Mr. Oliver, get out of here! Well, it's it's season eighteen. That was like abundantly clear that Toad hated all of her stories. Well, there's nothing I can do about it. Manager says I can't. Yeah. And, and that's it. Just like that. Well, it's not like we can Just do Oliver. whatever we want. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Andy, who's this train for? It's just I'll be right back. Straight. Why? Oliver and I'll take it. You know, save riddles the bother, and you could teach him for a bit longer too. Oh, well, all right then. I just need to get a break fan. Oh, don't worry. I'll just use Toad. Sure thing. I best be off then. Toad. Hey, I gotta go plus uh, Vegas Live. Say, I need to break fan. Okay. Now, are you going to help me or yeah. not? I think he broke some fat right now. Yeah. 
Doubleheader. Yep. Oh, LPS left. Yeah. Did she say anything when she? She probably just went to a different stream, I guess. Most likely. This is this is a double header in a nutshell, but it looks. Want to know my name? It's super long. That sense of freedom. Like you're on top of the world. Don't we all? Yeah. Still don't get why you want us to pull this train. Uh, there's no yes or no. I just felt like it. Now, come on, what? then enjoy what? yourself. Try and enjoy this. Do you, do you want me to say my name? It's a very long one. No, it, it's fine, dude. So, these wagons, all right. they've got goods in them. Probably a lot of really important stuff. Yeah, um, what are you getting at? Hey, what, what are you doing? What are you doing, mate? Tell me that, Oliver. Why do you keep pushing? Jinzy, come on, this isn't funny. Your choice, you know. You could easily stop. Save yourself the pain. See, Oliver's being stupid. He's pushing him. Why did you do that? Well, that Oliver oh, is strong. Know, just a test. Take it, that fool is strong. Oliver may be strong, but Jesus is just pushing him. Ahead of us. What's your choice? If you really want to know what I think, this would not work in blue train with friends. Yeah, they would just fall. Oliver only to... weighs 250 pounds. <laughs> you do that, then you fought the tracks. <laughs> or 200. That's why I have like a love hate relationship with blue train friends. Oh, no! They're about to crash, they're about to crash, they're about to crash! Ah! Oh, bro. That was a close one. Okay, that's a bro moment right there. Usually it goes a bit more smoothly than that. We were just about to give the warning about Amy's train being too long to fit on the goods loop. <laughs> that is duck. Usually can easily be carried. That is duck with per per That is duck with Percy's face, that's cursed. Yes, it is. She like 50 pounds. Only. These trains like weigh like a million pounds or something. It never gets old. Me, James. Um. Listen, Jeremy. Wait. I'm sorry. Like, 100. F for everything. We're only 37 minutes in. I'm sorry, too. Thank you. So, Jinzy, any other jobs? No, I don't think so. We're done for the day. So far, this is really great. Sounds like you've had an event. Okay, it wasn't that long. Say that again. My name wasn't that long. Try having to clear up the docks after him. It wasn't my fault. You need to give clear instructions. My instructions yeah. were perfectly fine. You young entrants have hearing troubles. I had everything you said. Shame. Oh yeah, because they can't hear because they have no ears. You couldn't listen though. Listen, Andy. Riddles may well become a good shunter. Just wasn't today. Thank you, Oliver. And it won't be tomorrow, or the day after that, or even the day after that. Hey. Someone full of How can they hear without ears? Oh, All right then. Jinty. You've been awfully quiet. Come on, tell us a bit about yourself. Um, not much to say, really. I'm a tank engine. I used to work at Euston. That's about it. Oh, yeah, and Toad's my brake van. Then, what would it be like if you had no ears? I, like I don't know. know. Don't give anyone ideas. It's uh, very nice. Okay. Where is it from? Oh, this old thing. It's, um, well... Have you guys ever heard of an island called Sodis? We he guys look as chumish. Delivered to the docks. Yeah, well... Mr. Thomas! Their railway controller arranged... To no, it's chumish. So in an exchange, me and a few other engines from Houston went to Sodis. No, I'm not. What? No, you're not. We arrived a few days before... What am I not? What? Where's the blue ding on my... 
It's a beautiful island. What's up? Everything oh. just felt so peaceful. <gasps> That's true! What happened to Pug? And it just felt right. Guess we'll never know. I was assigned he to was, work on the Park Park Brown flight. He was killed he in the military the war. And showed me how to do things. His name's Thomas. He's the one you see in the photo. No, it's Thomas. Ice engine. Thomas. If you ask me. Kept telling me and that's how Michelangelo said it. At the big station, longing for a chance to see the world. Then finally, about getting a chance to do so twice, in fact. If there was a SpongeBob uh, Thomas, and it would be. You got the branch. SpongeBob would, would be Thomas. Um, Patrick would be James. Me, James. Anything quite like it. Squidward okay. would be Gordon, and then Mr. Krabs. Let's get back to the film. I don't know, Henry. I think Henry was the fat controller. Everyone spam Thomas in the pro in the chat. They haven't quite finished. Thomas. It was the day before the Sodor engine. Spam this right now. Thomas. Thomas. It was about racing a bus along the branch line. Get it? I will come. An inch from the bus. What? Like this. Well, you can guess what happened next. I saw how damaged he was. He went through no a brick wall. If that happened here, they would have just given up, let it wait a while. But they didn't. I still remember looking in awe at that tank engine the next day, looking like brand new. They didn't have to fix him like that. They could have gone without him. Save a bit of money too in the process. R.I.P. Thomas Front. True freedom is for an engine. We're not the same as people. Freedom for us isn't running around doing what you want. Big why boy do big why boy change. You're not sucking yeah. Gordon's butt. Can, can, can I speak? Their why do their faces look so squished and their models like so squished in? Yeah, Henry looks I'm like sucking, I'm sucking. I'm sucking Gordon's butt. Henry what? Looks what? Henry looks smaller than James. It's just a memory. Yes. Now. Hey guys, it's Hen Hen. Yeah, it was well, Hen Hen. Henry. Henry the Hen. No, it's Henna, not Hen Hen. Very busy day. Henna, Henna. Hello. <laughs> I get what it. What's going on? Just tell me, Hen Hen. Does anyone know where the missing coaches are? I'm sorry, sir. The diesel is due to take its first train of the day, and the coaches have gone missing. It's like they've just vanished from the yard. They're right there. Okay, you go down the line and see if you can find them. I need to make a call. Bro, wait, where, where, where? Bro is talking to a faceless diesel. Where's Where's Oliver? I also have a Tommy Henna. <gasps> where's the oh, Olive? Oliver took them. I knew it. It's <gasps> the missing coach in a nutshell. Bro. Plot twist. It wasn't Donald and Douglas who lost the coaches. It was Oliver. Missing coach confirmed. <laughs> nope, it was Mr. Oliver. Well, not quickly. Remember that. Oliver's gonna do better. Mr. Oliver. These camera angles are amazing. Imagine not liking funk music. Wait a minute. Oh, I say. They got copyrighted. See, Oliver's doing it. He's 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 Chaliber. Chaliver. Chad B. It's Chad B. But the mini duck. Oh, Got a wow. mini duck. Chad. It's Chaliver now. But so beast him. Take that, Diesel. You should have. I didn't tell you. I didn't tell you to shut up. What? It was not you. It was Mix Traffic Mayhem Pro. No, I didn't. <laughs> 
When did By I the way, that? guys, like, I can't wait for Tobias and the Half Pariah 2, or Tobias and the Arcan Merchant. Me too. Oh my god, I thought that was my brother catching me. No more talking. I tried to keep my brother keep. I tried to keep my brother away from me being on your stream. Morning, then. Hello, Jinty. So here's the three chads. Chad B. What does Henry keep showing up? Great train robbery go well. I don't know. Tell you what. Chad is not too happy with Oliver. Morning, sir. Don't you dare act like you don't know what you did. Stealing the railway's coaches just to go gallivanting off with them. Uh, sir? What? What time does the first train normally arrive here? Well, with the diesel, it doesn't usually arrive for at least ten minutes from now. Why do you ask? <clears throat> well, I say. <laughs> no, that's... See, why is the controller being a jerk to him? Possible light. <clears throat> oh dear, it seems that uh, I may owe you a bit of an apology there, What Oliver, the heck? And, uh, yes? Looks like I'm going to have to make a few changes to the roster. You're back on the passenger run now. Well done, Oliver. Alright, nice work, Oliver. Oh, we knew you could do it. We I need to leave it. again in 50. Okay. Yeah, well, not okay. bad yourself. Thanks, Jinzy. I owe you one. Nah, don't mention it. After all, I wasn't the one who pulled the train. Just promise me something. I, I, I take kind of short to come back. Okay. This film has been really good. This has been really good. The, the shots, the voice acting, yeah, this is great, dude. That is some realistic coal. Yeah. This scene seems so peaceful because after a bunch of like drama, it's calm. Yeah. Toad. Hey. We've got to go. Mm. Is it time already, Mr. Ginny? Yeah, no trains out this way for another hour. You keep showing up. I don't know what's going on. Jinty, where are you going? Uh, must we leave so soon? It seems a shame to leave behind Mr. Oliver and his friends. Without even saying goodbye. Toad, you know we can't risk it. Control's an hotel, and I reckon the manager here is already pretty suspicious about us. Besides, look on the bright side. It's a clear night. It's been a while since we've had one of those. We're almost but done? Run ahead of us Eight out. minutes? Can we still Just watch it. Just watch it, Mr. Jinty. I know it's not the same as if they were awake to hear it, but it would be nice. Please, Mr. Jinty. Go on, then. After the movie yeah, ends, let's check. After the movie ends, let's check for an end credit scene. Mr. Yeah. Maybe, it was Maybe yesterday. that'll explain, like, what happened yeah. to Pug or something. Listen to Flying Kipper and watch it. But Mr. Jinty says we've got to go. It is ever so dangerous being on the run. Toad, you might want to wrap it up. Right, um, yes. Uh, well, well, what's I be to say? Uh, well, more, more succinctly, that is. Uh, goodbye, Mr. Oliver. And thank you for being a good friend. Right. Ready? Are it's been 50 minutes? Well, no. I don't do goodbyes. It doesn't have to be a goodbye. Wait, why is Jinty leaving? That's one thing I don't understand. Well, maybe. Uh, yeah. wait, 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 wait. Remember how Jinty had that piece of paper with him and Thomas on it? Yeah. Oh, what yeah. Jinty's a runaway himself. Yeah, true. All right, Toad. A reckless, overconfident, arrogant engine. And yet. And yet. You know, I don't doubt our paths will cross again. See you around, Oliver. 
now can we go looks, food? Looks Let's like all of our choking. Bye, Chode. He was a Chad. Wait, how is he looking at him if he doesn't have a face? Don't you feel like Jinty is kind of a Chad too? Jinty is like a Chad too. Oh no, he's going for him. What the heck? Bro. He just stays on Twitter for like, I don't know, like a week and then he leaves. Yeah, Mr. Oliver, he's gone. Is he apologizing? I don't know. For crying out loud, where is that blasted engine? Sir? Oh, it's just you, Oliver. Now this is very important. Have you seen Jinty? No, I think he left this morning. Left where? Left how? Please tell me you mean he took a train down to the docks. No, sir. I've got the first train today. If Jinty's gone, I think he's gone for good. Uh, seriously? No one just walks out like that and leaves. Leave. That's disrespectful. Any of it. I don't follow. It's fake. All of it. His papers, his correspondence with Control, even his builder's plate. Control reported to me... An engine sticking his way all across the country, all the way from you. This makes me laugh because where could he even be going? This makes me laugh inside because there. Aiden keeps showing up. It makes Wait, no I was right, sense. I was right. He, oh, Jinty is our ah! What do I keep doing, James Phil? Something I don't. He must be taunting me. He's got to be. Well, it's certainly a mystery, sir. Aha! You don't happen to know where he's going, do you? You engines, you talk to each other. He must have said something to you. Anything? Nope, nothing. Um, sorry to disappoint you, but I've really got to get back to work, seeing as I uh, very recently took back the passenger run. Yes, of course. As you were. I actually only listen with my dad. The Chad is doing it, people. The Ch Chaliver is doing it. See you around, Jinzy. <laughs> Mr. Oliver. Mr. Oliver. We're gonna say and spell our voice because I don't know how to because I don't know how to do Mr. Crab's voice. The Chad goes off to the distance. I won't listen any way. Yep. You don't know me. And I'll never be what you want me to be. Wait, are we done? No, that, there's, a, there's a post credits scene, I think. Yeah, there is. <gasps> yeah, there is! Everyone, be, everyone turn your mics off. I oh, really need to turn the lights off. I said Mike. Uh... 
Toad? How did you get here? What happened? They broke me. Toad. Toad. Yeah, it's all okay. No, they killed Jinty off. <gasps> they, Are you kidding oh, me? Oh my! Oh yeah, wait, Jinty died. Remember when Jinty was leaving, and then we saw the Diesel's headlights come on? Yeah. The Diesel attacked. Wait, Jinty we're dumb. Because the Diesel had Toad when he came back. We're dumb. So the Diesel took. <gasps> Oh, um, look what! The Are you diesel, kidding me? The Bro. diesel followed Jinty, ambushed him, stole Toad, and headed back to the branch line. Anyways, anyways, here's the outro song, and thank you all. This was actually amazing. What's your guys' yeah. scores on it? It's Alec Baldwin's high song. Yep. Let's go. First off, before we end it, what's your guys' scores on this movie? I give it an eight out of ten. Uh, I give it like a eight point one out of ten because I don't know. There, the only the only thing was I don't really know. Okay, that's it. We're playing the outro song. Thank you for watching, and ha thank you for watching. Subscribe for a pizza, and here's the outro song. Let's go. His addiction is the view. Coke and weed and beer and mess. He's a fucking horrid mess. He really thinks that friends are not. Doing drugs around the clock. Doing so much he could die. Goodbye. Thank you all for watching.